Hello, this is Running Robert, and today we are playing Station to Station. So this is a voxel art, voxel art train strategy game. Say that three times fast. Uh, it's made by Galaxy Grove. They are an independent developer out of the Netherlands. This is their first game. As you can see, the art style is very unique. So we're going to get right into it. So I've already kind of started to go through the levels, having a good time with it. So we're just going to go start back at Greendale and start with really the tutorial level, level one. So very simple level. Pretty much all we have to do here is complete, all 11, uh, connect or complete all 11 buildings. So it's pretty simple. Again, we're going to have our movement on we up, down, and great. Okay, so first thing we're going to do, we're going to mouse over the building to see what it is. This produces wheat. It's a wheat farm. That makes sense. If I press spacebar, I can place my station. I want to make sure that station is connected to that white line. And then I want to click my second station, of course, over here. And connect that there. Now this is a mill. It needs wheat. So again, these kind of go together. I can connect my buildings pretty simple through there. And they're just standard freight. There's cards that we'll, we will discuss later. And that is good. So, I got money. I unlocked the buildings, which is over here. What you need for your progress to unlock buildings. And we're going to add them. Okay. Great. So, now that we move over, we see the wheat is completed. Each wheat farm can supply one mill. And so, each one needs a separate wheat farm. So, of course, now we have another wheat farm here. Here. And a wheat in a mill over there. So, of course, we're going to be connecting all of those. Let's go ahead and do that. We'll connect to the buildings right there. Now, you see here, I built the station too close, as we kind of zoom in. So, I cannot use the station, this connection anymore. Because this railroad is too close to it. And I just wanted to kind of zoom out to see how nice it was. So, we're going to move that back down there. And we're going to do the same thing here. Each station can have up to four. Obviously, if it goes red, it has less. So sometimes it's good. Sometimes you can use it. Sometimes not. So we will connect all of that. As we get more money, we will open up more buildings. And now we're going to open up others. Okay. And go in base bar. And base bar to get that going. So we need to start building from the station. And it wants me to go to this waypoint over here. So I'm going to select this waypoint and I'm going to select this. Now, the bridge is very expensive. So you can see that this bridge itself costs $57. Uh, dollars. So if I move it, you can see the price goes down. So up here, it's cost me about 164 to build the bridge and the tracks. We're here, it's 133. That actually works a lot better. So we'll go ahead and we'll do that. And we've opened that up. So again, very nice. New buildings. Okay, so what do we have here? Dairy farm. So this is one of the things that produces more than just one. So each of these requires a milk. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to build that here. This is the last one. So we can kind of be a little sloppy with it. Not a big deal. So we're going to connect him there but you can see that red so sometimes you might want to take that connection out there so you have more track to use now we click here only one milk has been used we still have the other one free again we're going to go over here and i kind of get that station going and make our final connection and we've completed the level so lots us now at some point if we wanted to look kind of look at what we have going on here so you can see the different carts that are organized a little cheese factory here always wonderful if you look at the mill the buildings all look different um for the thing and then of course just a close-up of what they are carrying again very beautiful game very simple game a little bit harder to master as you get up there and of course there's a puppy dog so we love it already okay so we're gonna go to the next level so this one comes with the star challenge we're gonna talk about that in a second so let's go ahead and get into it so the goal is to complete the 14 buildings and create long railroads with a combined length of over 2,200 meters. Okay. Let's see what this building does. This is a bakery, so it needs flour to make bread. Okay. Flour comes from the mill. Wheat comes from that. 
So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna do our first here. Here and a connection here. Again, instead of just going over and having an expensive $150, we're gonna go around. And it's only 67. First train done. And then again, the same thing with this. We'll just kind of snake it down and make that connection. So now we have the wheat to the flour to the bakery. And then down here, we can see that currently I have 331 meters of track. Okay. What do we have here? We have a town. So the town requires bread, milk, cheese, and fish. We have fish and we have bread. So let's go ahead and we're going to get this thing ready. So one of the things that we want to do is you want as many connections as possible when you're connecting some. So what I mean by that is it's more money if I connect the bakery and the fish at the same time. So that's what we're going to try to do. I'm going to go down here and just kind of build this one back down this way. And then from there, I'm going to build my city. And you can see, I'm not sure I went through that that quick. That's going to be delivering both of them to it. When that occurs, I get stack bonuses. That means more money. More money for building. Okay. So, another thing to go over really quick. You can see where there is construction sites where the next buildings will be made. So, we kind of have an idea that there's going to be a building here, here. Very good to look at that when you're planning out kind of how to do your stuff. Okay, so... We have the cheesery. It needs some cheese. So, again... Gonna connect that right there. You're gonna connect cheesery up there. I just like saying the word cheesery, I'm not gonna lie. So that's gonna be one connection. And then I can actually, if you want, like I said, I can connect it over there. It's still going to work the same as connecting it over here. So sometimes this is 93, that's 969. It can work either way just to make the connections a lot easier. Go get my stack bonus. And new buildings. Okay, so what do we have? Okay, so I have another, again, this wheat mix. We also have a couple buildings coming on over here, it looks like. So let's go ahead, we'll get those being made. Let's see, let's connect that there. And because I played this before, I kind of know how these connections might work. We're just gonna eat a little bit because I already know how this works. We're gonna get that over there. And we're gonna get that over there. That's why I can actually connect downward. So there is some planning required for it. Okay. So I can press tab to see incomplete buildings if I need to. Okay. So this is the last thing that we are needing. And of course, we're looking for that stack bonus. We're also looking to get those meters of track. So let's go ahead and let's get that going. So uh, what we're going to do is I need a four connection. Tree. It's the way I want to plan it. So I want to connect everything through the fishery first and then connect the fishery out. Let's see how we can make that work. Well, the first thing, of course, is I don't want to block off those tracks in there. That can go over there. Like I said, this. We're maybe going a little bit. Oh, I went too far. Let's try that again. Nope, not quite there. I'm trying to get it so I don't. There we go. Okay, so that is now all connected. We need layer 1600. You gotta make sure we're checking our track distance, of course. Making sure we are in good shape. There we go, look at that. Okay. That's 1900 meters. Uh, let's just... Let's just so I wanna make sure I have enough track connected, just so, you know, just to be safe. So we can just go ahead and we're just gonna Connect that in there. Yeah, that's gonna get me close. And I don't think I really have any money, any more good tracks I can connect. 
to there. Okay, so now I've, I've hit my star bonus. That's great. With the extra tax, I had the extra money. So now, like I said, we can finish this level off by going right here. And I'm going to get that stack bonus because everything is being delivered into that area. So there we go. And that is all the buildings and all the levels. So you can kind of see how it goes. Again, we're going to zoom up on the towns. I think the, the towns are very well like built, just how they kind of come in there. Got a little train coming in. And a horse. Look at that. Again, super awesome, super nice. You can see actually all the freight that's being delivered there. So this is a pretty long train. So let's move on to the next. So I got the buildings and I got my challenge. Sweet. So we took it easy on the other first one, so let's go ahead and get the next level of that. Okay, so let's see, complete all 14 uh, buildings, end the level with at least $500, and complete the level without creating more than 2,000. So this one's a little bit different than the previous one. Okay. Where is my building? Okay. Uh, it looks like... Pretty simple. I need, I have mills and I have wheat. Okay. I have a thousand dollars. And then this one, I need to save that money. So we're going to be trying to go a little cheaper here. If we can. So let's go ahead and move that track. It's not bad. Okay. Yep. Oh, this is, like I said, uh, and to save the bakery can receive flour indirectly by the station. Okay. Yep, because I, this one, like I said, what he's saying, even though the wheat is moved to here, any connection counts. So I don't need to connect it directly. I can make these very simple connections here and not have to worry about it. What do we have? We have, oh, and at the end, this is going to be the, the, the dairy farm with the cheesery. Love it. We love our cheeseries. Okay, so head and let's... Make sure we're make, putting that connection in there. Again, we're going to just kind of... Oops, I don't want to go over that. And for this station, like, I know I'm going to have to kind of go in this direction. Because I know everything's going to be built over here. Like, nothing's going to be built anymore over here. That's the end of the map. So we're going to go over here. Like, so that's going to kind of change how we're going to build. And there we go. Okay. All the networks work. Let's see what we have going. Fishery. Okay. Again, we want to connect everything at once. We're going to build that far enough away so that we have an option to do stuff. Again, we're going to connect that station. It's blocked. We want to go just a little bit out just to make sure we keep that open. And then there. Okay, so, and everything's going to come in, so this is where we're going to get that wonderful stack bonus. There we go. That's nice. Okay, so we need to, we're, we're good for the track so far, and we have currently $800. We need to finish with five. Okay, so they're going to, they're going to give us everything here. Okay. That's how we're going to play this game, I guess. Again, I need to connect all these buildings. I'm going to do the same thing where I'm going to pretty much connect it to this wheat farm. We need to find a way to make sure that we get a good connection where everything can connect. We're going to kind of go right there. If I figure I'll get the two connections from here in. And then the one connection here. I kind of go from there. So let's go ahead and let's get this building. Get that out as far as possible. Because I don't want to... I have to build a bridge if I don't have to. There we go. That was a good connection. Same thing here. Again, I'm trying to not use that other connection. Okay, so how are we doing? Okay. So far, so good. Okay. That's going to be an expensive connection. We're going to see... You know what? We're going to see something first. We're going to put this here. We're going to put this over here for the moment. What we're going to look at is how much this connection cost me. 
125. How much is this connection going to cost me? 105. So what we're seeing here, we can we can move these now to the a, a better location. But what I'm really going to do is instead I'm going to make this very easy connection there. And he's just going to make that $93 connection there. So again, I've saved money, I've saved track length, get over here. And of course we're going to connect there. You're going to get a little bit of money for the stack bonus for some of the stuff that is over there. But... We're going to get the main bonus right here. And we are under 2,000. And we're going to be over 500. So that's what we have. So we completed it. Again, I do like that we can kind of go through and like look at our levels as we can finish. You can see everything. And they, like I said, they even animate the burn. I asked this ridiculous. You know, just the level of details are going through it with the cities and everything like that. So I do like the church in the middle. It looks really nice. I could live there. Ooh, cows. Okay. We're done there. We hit our fun challenge and we hit our special challenge. Wonderful. Okay. Let's see the next level. Finish. Let's see, we have a couple things here. Let's see what we have. Okay, so the 14 buildings uh, end with at least seven and complete the level without placing any bridges. That's a nice one. Okay. Oh, and there's a giant river in the middle. Oh, and there's lots of places to put bridges if you need to. Okay. Okay. Okay, so we do have something here that is good mentioning. I can connect both these buildings with that right there. That will be very nice. I am trying to save money. I'm trying to get that as far away as possible. I can connect this. There we go. And so that was a little expensive. But once a railroad is completed, you can't touch it. So if you do mess up, you gotta reload from the checkpoint. So uh, that kind of sucks. But again, that train is making a very scenic little tour down the way. Let's go ahead and let's look at our next uh, stations that we have to do. Uh, so we have the mill. So this, these are a little bit further apart. And it looks like I have to go down here and then connect way up there. Look for, it looks like we have some construction sites in other locations. Let's go ahead and let's get this started. But we'll go with that one first. And with that next. Okay. And let's make this track down. Okay. And. Get that. There we go. Okay. The one thing I can do is if I need, I can place like an interim station in there. And that might actually work out really well for here. There's going to be a construction site like right there. So maybe I can I can cut it with this lower one. I just don't want to cut off any that is and not build any bridges. There we go. Okay. Let's see if that works for now. New buildings can go right there, of course. There's the cities and two fisheries. Okay. Again, we know this from before. I'm going to connect to the fisheries. Go ahead and get that as close as possible. That simple connection there. We're going to destroy some of this town, but we're going to connect to our fishery here. Everything we need. We're going to get our stack bonus. Again, we're going to try to do the same thing over here. So let's go ahead. Let's open. Oh, oh. I did not get close enough. So I need. To, I'm going to remove that building. Need to get. 
There we go. Okay, so that's good. This is the price. So what we're going to do is we're going to try to connect it up first. We do have a couple more buildings up here. So we got to make sure we leave a con one of these connections. Go ahead. We're going to connect it around. There we go. I think that'll work. And we're going to put our city. Here. We're going to see if... Oof, we made it. No bridges. And a nice little stack bonus. Okay, what else are they sending us our way? Okay, so we have... Let's see. Those so cities require cheese and milk. So this looks like a fairly easy connection over here. Let's go ahead and knock that one out first. See if I can actually, yep, okay, I can make that connection there. Deal, we're just gonna make that right there. Gonna, like I said, make that one right there. Awesome. And get the stack bonus. We need to stay above $700. We're pretty good right now. Okay, so this is where we're going to see what we can do. So we'll build that there. We're going to build this right here. That first connection is right there. And then when I connect it to this city, I shall be done. Do that. 108. Hey, I'm still well over. Look at that. There you go. Level complete. And look at the nice, we have the cities, we have all the trains running. Again, I do like, like I said, for some of the trains that are carrying less, there's only, this one only has like a single load on it. Same with that one, but this one, it's carrying everything. And there's a bird flying right past me. Okay, so we're doing well. 14, hit the fun challenge and the special challenge. Okay, and now the last level. So finish the level with money and or we're not sure what this is. Okay. So end the money with 900. Save a total of 300 by using cards. Okay, so we're going to get introduced to the card system now. Use cards to reduce the cost for railroad. Like new buildings, cards can be obtained after connecting resources. There are many different cards to you. Okay, so. This is definitely the first card we're going to use. So we have a fishery over here. And this place wants fish. Okay, that's simple enough. Ed, and we're going to make fish. I think there's really going to be much of a chance to move stuff around here. So we'll go with that. But I will do the connection. And oh, before I do it, it's really expensive. I am going to make it cheaper. That's going to make it now 80 for the cheap rail. We will now get more carts. Bridges, and means we're probably going to be building up. Okay. Yeah, we have the weed farm and that going together. So yeah, that I have to build because it's, yeah, it's stuck up there. Let's go ahead. We're going to get this going. And we're going to get this going. Again, we're going to make that connection. But that is expensive, so we're going to use that bridge. Make it cheaper. And now we have a whole bunch of cards. Well, they're just going to give us everything, huh? Okay. Again, I don't have a lot of money left at the moment, so we're going to have to be a little cheap with this. So we're going to go ahead, we're going to build this. Let's see. What do we have? What do we have? We gotta look at what we have. Oh, the cheeseries are there. My milk is. Milk is the dairy's farms and the cheeseries are up here. But it's a hard knock life. And then we have another wheat farm over there. Flour and bakery. Okay, so let's go ahead and get this one done first. Go ahead, we're going to build that over here. 
Uh, we're not going to block off the tracks. Anyways, let's use the cheap rails. That will get me some money. Bricks. Okay. Okay, so now I need to really work on this connection over here. Go ahead, let's get him over here. This is a very simple connection right there. Let's use the cheap rails. I am going to have to... I'm going to build him first. And he's just going to have to be the connection. And cheap rails. I need to save the money. I will get some money for that, which is what I was looking for. Again, I think if I connect this and this together, uh, we want to make sure we're using the right ones, cheap rails, these. Okay. And then we're just going to make that connect there. Need to make sure I do something. 90, 150 at the point. Okay, so let's go ahead. Let's connect this last one here. This is a very simple connection. Very cheap. Okay. Now the last connection we need. Which, like I said, I believe everything is connected for the moment. So I'm going to use him. I'm going to use these cheap bridges to do that as a connection. And so I get my stack bonus because I definitely need it. Whew. Okay, let's go ahead. Drawing cards, cheap bridges, cheap rails. And what are we building here now? Oh, is that it? What do we have here? We have more cheese wreaths. Okay. Doesn't seem so hard. Is that all my buildings? We I mean, pretty close, like almost all the buildings. Nine of fourteen. Well, I mean that's a pretty easy connection. So let's go ahead. Let's just put this. I did not connect that the way I probably should have, fortunately. So I'm kind of I did something to myself. I kind of blocked off a lot of stuff that I need to do. So that's 70, that's 80. The cheap bridges, it's 15, it's 51. That's 70. So we're going to go with that at the moment. Hopefully that's the last one I'll need. And let's, let's go ahead and get this first before we do anything else. Okay. Oh, that was a mistake. Okay. Well... Okay, so we have to do some work here. One, I have that over here. That's a little bit far away. But let's see if I can connect it to... Here. Use the cheap rails on that. And we can make that easy connection there. And this is where, let's see. Wait right to here. 113. I think it's as cheap as I'm gonna, it's only one bridge. We can look at other connections, 156. That was 130, yeah, that's the cheapest I'm gonna get. Oh, we got the stack bonus. Let's see if it is enough. It's gonna be awfully close. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> there you go. And so that is our first five levels. Again, you can see how they kind of build. And then this is definitely a new archetype city that we're going to be getting into the next land. They can see how definitely it is different. That train is going up such a grade. Okay, so let's go. We can go ahead and hit next from there. Again, I finished that. I have finished my fun challenge. And I have finished my special challenge. That is done. So the next place, like I said... On this one, we got all three of three challenges, five of five, 
and 404. So now we're moving on to the next area, which will be Sunforge Dance, which is going to be a lot different than what we had before. And, you know, I hope this has really given you a good thought of what this game is. Like I said, it is a lot of fun. We're going to continue to play it, uh, you know, a good amount. I think it's definitely something that interests me. And yeah, so hopefully you have had fun watching and listening. Thank you very much, and I hope you have a wonderful day.